replay. Love to see you here. But I'm just going to sit here patiently and wait. Oh, my hair looks bad. It's pulled too tight. Sit here patiently and wait while it loads. And I've got a burp coming as well. Ugh. That was my burp. Nice, right? Um, what's all this ghost chat in the chat? We are playing ghost ghost tonight. What's that? I think someone is ghost ghost. What? I don't understand. <laughs> mm. What? It's taking forever to come on. Come on. Here we go. Superior seal for outdoor to seal out extreme and seal in energy. Hi everyone. Hi besties. How's it going? Hi Paula. Hi Emma. Hi Pam. Hi Amanda. Hi Kirsty. Hi Sharon. Hi Siri. Siri, have you seen the new emojis being uploaded? We've got loads of emojis thanks to Siri. Uh, hi Deborah. Hi Daniel. Hi Foxy. Hi Gillian. Hi Ben. Hi Beth. Hi Nano Noodles. Looking stunning in green Nano Noodles. Hi Terry. Hi Naomi. Hi Natasha. Hi Amanda. Hi Gillian. Hi Tina. Hi Carmen. Hi Becky. Hi Stephanie. Hi Maddie. Hi Millie. Hi Kirsty. Hi Beth. Hi Erin. Hi Emily. Hi Amelia. Hi Sophie. Hi Rebecca. Hi Kirsty. How are you all? Hi, Sally Ann. Hi, Diana. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Matthew. Hi, Jill. Hi, Mandy. Hi, where you two budgets. Hi, Emma. I love it when you wear that hoodie. You look like you're going to get into slippers. Oh, I've got trainers on. This is the best. This is my favourite hoodie. It is literally just a normal hoodie. I bought it from Next, like, must have been about like six years ago and it is like mm, it's lovely i feel like uncle festa I feel like an absolute slug in this but it's cozy i like it uh did you peek the inhaler yes i did i did i said i loved it uh, i was going through my challenges i found the donut trust ira and dice challenge like the blank squaces on the back and the camera four side dice nice i'm really good huntella how are you hi andrea hi latanya I'm happy now my Easter break has started two weeks off on uni. Good for you. Gillian Open Etsy Store is stunning. <gasps> Gillian, what's your Etsy store called? Let me take a look. Let me see if you copied me. Etsy.com. Um, would it be called Gillian Budgets? Gillian Budgets. Oh, I can't spell budgets. Um, um, what's it called? What's it called? Uh, Ira could be cousin it. Thank you. <laughs> Three more days till Lent is over and I can eat chocolate. Nice. The Geordie Maker. Right, let's have a look. The Geordie Maker. Maybe if we go etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash the Geordie Maker. No. Okay. The Geordie Maker. Don't you just love coming on here and watching me google stuff i'm gonna get you a link bestie so you can all watch have a look at it with me okay we've got a dice challenge we've got a roll with it be unique that's cute oh that's emoji dice that's nice hopes and dreams badger Disney, when shit happens, Etsy splurge. These are cute. I really like, which one do I like the best? I like this emoji one here. There's like an emoji one and it's got all the, it's got dice. So you roll and you have an amount per, that's a good idea. I like that. Uh, how much is it? Four pounds, bloody bargain. Bestie, you're not making much money from that. Come on, Georgie Maker. Six sales, nice. These are a bit cheap, I would say. Bestie, I'd raise your prices, know your worth. 
that's all I'll say on it. Cute, cute, cute. Angel and Lorf challenge, yes. <laughs> the dog challenge is my fave. Jill and is from last night. I got my Mermaid 4.5k dice challenge yesterday. It took a week to get to Australia. Do you know what? A week, not bad. I've had a lot of people who I posted it on the 13th are saying I haven't got it. So big old amount of stuff like to deal with but yeah even all stream wouldn't load on tv app for me oh oh i'm on top chat <laughs> sorry tina live chat the ivs is sweet for people who need it i'm ordering from you jill in thursday friday they look stunning keep it in mind i've only made 30 pounds this week <laughs> some reason it's really quiet and i'm not saying that for pity really really quiet i mean i haven't made 30 pounds i've spent like a lot of money on postage my labels haven't come from the uk from the 11th gotta love royal match you know what mental but i haven't done any labels in a long time beth so have i actually done it i haven't yet but we'll do the post office today Q. um okay so how are we all doing uh we've got a lovely uh poll at the moment it says should we release a small 2k saving challenge when we hit 2k subs on don't trust iris so far 90 percent are yes absolutely six percent say only budget of iron milestones count which i understand and four percent say pee -pee -pee -pee. <laughs> oh i've done something scary as well today and then the pinned comment is for the new Jigsaw Savings Challenge. So that is super cute. Let me get you a link for it. Um, it's super cute. So it's the one I sneak peeked the other day. Uh, like really, really cute. So Sugar Daddies will be getting that. Uh, can you explain the poll, please? I think I just... Dead. I haven't yet, but I'll go to the post office today. I got my mermaid challenge arrived. I had to hide a dice from my hubby. He is a dice geek, is he? Um, I have ordered the restock of the mermaid challenge and then uh, ordered the stocking of a new dice challenge as well. Uh, going to order this week on payday. I need the Etsy Splurge challenge because the ransacked is next week. Is it? I mean, you said you had two weeks ago. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I love dice. I've started collecting them, but I have more than I ever be able to use. Right? Can you imagine if you just took every amount of dice and just rolled it and went, okay, guess I'm saving that. I guess I pressed the wrong button in the poll. What did you press? Pee pee poo poo. I've had a bad day today. I've fallen out with DPD. Ah, oh, easily happened, bestie. We've had many a row. They were supposed to be delivering my brand new phone and they didn't even attempt it. The driver just put sorry I missed you. So if they turned up to just put that. Oh. Uh, what did you click do? We can't can count it together as the other one, assuming it's only the right answer. Everyone hit the like button so we don't forget. Oh yeah, we'll do a sneak peek at 150 likes. So if we want a sneak peek, we'll do 150 likes and we'll do the sneak peek of the design of the new 4.5k challenge. Uh, my internet is good, doesn't, I'm not dropping any frames, so it might just be you. Is anybody else having any uh, freezing issues? Uh, if you do a challenge for Don't Trust Iron, it needs to be more cheeky than normal. Oh yeah, it'd be ridiculous, wouldn't it? If it's Don't Trust Iron, it'd be actually ridiculous. I'll have to do a piss challenge. <laughs> uh, I have more than I have shown. I probably need about 40 sets of dice more coming in the round. Nice. <laughs> uh, not bother, my body is freezing. <laughs> um, what did you all have for your tea? I had jacket potatoes. That's like a standard Tuesday dinner. Jacket potatoes. We have raw onion and cheese and butter. It's absolutely delicious. How are we enjoying these new emojis as well? Uh, just waiting for Siri to pull a finger out or their finger out, sorry. Um, come on, where are they? <laughs> you will have to suggest the dice roll to my D&D &D playing daughter on her next payday. Yes. Wait for Subway. Nice. Jack and potato yum. I had chicken curry with some rice dishes. I love chicken curry. You know, I had tea yet. Saw it out. Piss challenge sounds fun. You'd love it. Oh my God, that sounds lush. Need to try that. Love Jack and potato. <laughs> I don't know why that spelling <laughs> of potato has tickled me. Potato. <laughs> <laughs> your Hank Marvin, yeah. Sounds like the peak and inhaler are your emails. Ooh. I wonder if um Siri. Oh. 
Siri, Siri. I've just got the last one I've got is high emote and I've got emotes uh, from the 19th. Oh, Siri. Oh, sorry. My not C-I-R-I. I don't think I have it. Uh, junk. Oh. Uh, 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 oh no, which one is what? Okay, okay, right. Uh, got inhaler. I'm gonna zip, unzip it. Oh, that's so good. Did you say there was another one? Did you say there was another one? There's another one. The peak, peak, peak. And the inhaler, oh, peak. Perfect. Right. They are so good. I wonder if I can add them. Studio.youtube. I'm not going to get anything done today if I do this. Um, let me see. I'm going to try and add them now. See if you can see them all. Emoji. Add. Select image. And we want inhaler. It's so good. It's so, so, so good. Inhaler. Inhale. I can have 15 emojis. And then the other one is peak. That's so good. Peak. Did we do peak? We didn't do peak. So at the moment, we've got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, I'm going to save it and publish and see if you can see it all. Okay. They're on there, so you might be able to get them now. Add emotes. I can see the wave. I don't know if you can see it. Um, potato... <laughs> Ranch chicken pie, nice. Home my chicken pie again. Had it yesterday too. With mashed this time was fried yesterday. Nice. Uh, what's your favourite emoji, Ira? And your least emoji? I like using... I like using um, that. Uh, but what I hate using is that one. I hate that one. Chicken curry and naan. Nice. Chickpea curry with rice. Oh, look, they're on already. Oh, that's so good. Cheesy chips are so good. Uh, I found myself on all takeaways for two months. Oh, that's going to be hard. Not going to lie, my ego has been inflated since making the most because of you guys. They're so good, though, Siri. My phone. Uh, I mean, uh, by myself, Emma, this is... Uh, <laughs> they're so good. These are so good. Well, what colours have we got? We need, like, one in each colour. Like, like, have you noticed I've got a different colour hoodie on in each one? They're so good. My favourite is the inhaler one. We're going to replace all of the ones I did. They are so good. They're so good. Ah, uh, so if you are watching this, like... On, a, on the repeat, like pull up the chat because everyone's spamming them like crazy. Uh, that's so cute. Yeah, we'll get rid of all of them. We'll get rid of Forbid Forbidden Binder, all of it. <laughs> we need a teal one. Okay, well, you know, tell the person in charge of making them. Okay, so today we're going to be packing some orders. Uh, we've got like 35, 37, something like that. Uh, quite a couple orders. Are you going to keep the rainbow donut? Of course. Uh, a yellow jumper one. Uh, if you click on, so if you go to chat, you click on the emoji picture, then you click on budget with Ira, you'll be able to see them. Deborah, you can't get rid of her and binder. <laughs> Been watching loads of old videos all day at work. Best day ever. Oh, that's cute. They're so cute. So we've got a yellow hoodie, a pink hoodie, a purple hoodie, a red hoodie, and a blue hoodie. So we need green and teal. Yeah. Can we get a piss binder one for laughs? <laughs> they look good. I've messaged you on Etsy. Okay. Got my next three months of Patreon's worth of Patreon saved. Cute. Cute. Well done. Uh, okay. So yeah, we're packing order. So we're probably... 
we'll probably go and do that in a sec. Um, what do I need to tell you? Nothing really. I'm feeling on top of everything. Can you see anything you shouldn't? No. Really tidy and um, sorted I am. There's an idea of making one where Ira is the donut. Love that. Love that. Uh, for shits and giggles, Daniel Lowell. <laughs> okay, right, I've got my phone. It's on charge at the moment, so I think it will be okay if I pull up the stream. Any updates on Jakey? Yeah, he's doing really, really well. Um, Just living life, just doing really well. So if I go and search, don't trust Ira, find this, skip through the ad. Oh, that's a good idea. Refresh the chat. So if I go and pause, then I've got the chat here. We can go and pack some orders. So when do you think you run out of binders? Oh, I don't know. What about the SS boxes? SS boxes. I've joined the SS. <laughs> I have not joined the SS. S boxes. Those pictures on your phone are adorable, right? Someone's drawn you cute pictures. Secret Santa boxes. What about... We don't... Secret Santa's completely sold out. <sighs> Think April's bestie. Oh, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. They're just green boxes, all right? Right, so we turn it... Th no. This way round, don't we? I need to see what you can see. Is this flickery? Is it good? Where are we at? This way round, don't we? I need to... Okay, that looks terrible. I've got it right in my way as well. Okay, well, that's good. I'm gonna have to move it along. Oh, Bestie, I'm sorry. This is gonna be really annoying for you, but I do need to move it along. So it's, I didn't plan it out very well. I've buggered this stand as well. <laughs> I love how professional my live streams are. This looks okay to me. How does this look all right? Nothing special. Uh, got them. Tina could never get banned. <laughs> no, she couldn't. Ira, right, dare you not to dare you not to ban a sugar that can you imagine if I did? I plan on ordering a beginner box on the four on the first. Law would be on vacation, but find a way to order one. I haven't banned anyone. Maybe the spanners have. I don't know. Can you imagine if I ban Tina? I mean, I might do it for the lols. <laughs> it would be pretty funny. <laughs> I don't like the angle. I have to keep on fixing it. Okay, that angle will do. Okay, so let's start with Laura. We've got a 1K dice challenge in blue. Absolutely stunning, babes. Now let's find the blue one. Justice for Tina. I haven't banned anyone. You miss grinder guy. <laughs> Same. <laughs> oh, I need stickers. <laughs> grinder guy. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> I genuinely had no idea who that was. <laughs> I miss grinder guy. Who was he and what did he do? He just as uh, someone random came on the stream and says, "Why did you block me on grinder?" I was like, "Babes, I don't even have grinder. What are you talking about?" And then that was that. And then he got blocked. Isn't Tina ghosting today? Yeah, probably. Probably. 
probably what should have been Siri who's ghosting can't have an upside down happy mail uh, next we've got Gina Benjamin that's a good name Gina Benjamin but if your name's Gina and you're a close friend of me I always call you Gina because that's perfect name isn't it so Gina's ordered geometric marble I think there's either one left or it's sold out and a rainbow four and a half K. Hi, Daniel. Tina is busy. What are you busy with, Tina? What's more important than tonight? I need to order again, get another cash. It's my birthday on the 4th. wonder if there's anything new is coming out on my birthday. The 4th? Oh, I don't know. Well, something's coming out on the 1st. Oh, do you know what? I made a terrible mistake last night. Um... So on BBC iPlayer, they've got Interview of a Vampire, which is not the original film. They've like redone it. And it's the first half and it's like a series. And I am obsessed. I'm going to watch it again. But I watched every single one and I was up until three o'clock in the morning watching it. It was so good. Like so good. Like really good. I can't recommend enough. Irene Anderson. Uh, Irene's ordered two 100 envelope challenges, so let's grab them. So fast, Tina can't come to the phone right now. Who needs Taylor Swift when we have Tina talks with her husband, right? Yeah, she's probably shagging someone's husband, to be honest. You know what she's like. I haven't bought from Ira for a couple of days. You've got withdrawal symptoms. <laughs> I think I'm packing one of your orders tonight, Gillian. So <laughs> I can't keep up with your orders. <laughs> She does like a good husband. She goes, oh, we do love a husband. <laughs> Binge that series too. I, it was so good. My family's trying to take my card because I own half of your Etsy store. <laughs> you do as well. 84 likes. It is so good. The original, like, I was too young when it came out, so I've never really watched it, but oh my goodness, it was so good. I, I can't imagine the um, original being as gay as this one was, because it was, it's very gay. It's very good. I do like it. June Jaws. June Dawes. And we've got a two of the new dashboards. So here's the new dashboards. Everybody who says, I want new dashboards, here they are. They're beautiful. I don't know what the next sticker's gonna be. Probably be one of these dashboards. I wonder why I ordered. It, it's bad, Gillian, if you can't remember what you've ordered. <laughs> 
Uh, I've been watching all the vlogs from the beginning on Budget of Iro Vlog 33. Wow, you're not far off the end. I love slow progress is still very, it's good, isn't it? I'm a genius for that, I tell you. I'm so talented, you guys. <laughs> This is a nice name. This is Inga Oort. Isn't there such thing as an Oort cloud? Or did I make that up? So it's a 200 envelope challenge. Not buying the scratch off dashboard, rude. Why would you, what? Not buying the scratch off dashboard read. I just rewatched Bridgerton, forgot how good it was. I really disliked the second series. I really liked the first one. But I've never thought to go back because I was so offended by how just pants the second one was. It's not gay enough either. Talent isn't so humble, right? Just lucky you caught me on a good mood. Half the time I'm like, why am I such a flop? Forensic is amazing. There, is there a 300 scratcher? Only one missing from the set? Yeah, oh yeah, it's um, sold out because it's green scratch offs and they're so hard to find. Uh, is there actually, there is a 300, 300 is gold, there's a 350, which is the emerald. And I actually think I've got one, two, two, yeah, two. Um, but I need to put them in stock. Okay. Next, we've got Leanne Arrowsmith. That's a nice name. Leanne Arrowsmith. Okay, so we've got one of each of the dashboards, the new ones. And then we've got Paisley Pink six pack and Tilbit six pack. Beautiful. Yeah, it didn't make sense that we, you know, they give up who was Lady Bridgerton at the end of the first season. Like, it would have been better if we just didn't know, I think. A bit like Gossip Girl. You only find out in, like, season, the very, very last episode. The original interview with a vampire was good for its time, especially the young girl. I might, I might watch it, but I think I'd rather we rewatch the new one. I watched uh, flashy funerals on Amazon Prime last night. Can't believe some of them. Really, Sharon Gill. It's a blue rock paper scissors. Let's actually get the rock, paper, scissors out. Where did I put it here? So I think there's a couple of them coming. Put it here. So we've got a blue dice and a blue rock, paper, scissors. By the way, I'm not redoing these. <laughs> these were not fun to make. What's Tammy sleep shopping? What do you mean? What happened? I've forgotten how to draw a hoodie. Well, I look like a bag of mayo, so you can do any shape really, you'll be all right. Oh good, glad you're happy. Original young girl in interview of a vampire was Kirsten Dunst. Oh, Dunst. Oh, that's good. Tammy sleep shop Timu, did she? Oh God. Oh God. 
So all of these orders getting packed tonight. They'll be taken to the post office tomorrow. What's this order? This one's a big one. No, it's not that big. So we're going to go here. This one's Kathy Hazel. I'm on top messages. All messages. Tammy Sparrow, £40 on Timu when sleeping, was confused when the postman came to her. No. Oh. Just all feet with Camilla coming to the cathedral opposite where I work. Oh, really? Right, we got Merry Cashmas with the envelope. So Merry Cashmas envelope. We've got 200 envelope challenge. With the stickers. And we've got a, a 900 scratch off, which is the Ruby. Lovely red one. And we've got slow progress is still progress. Or do you know what? If we can get through these orders tonight, we'll uh, I'll show you the the finished product of the the jigsaw challenge. How does that sound? That's a tough thing to deal with, sleep shopping. You could do, you could buy a car. Thank God it was only 40 quid on Timu, do you know what I mean? Imagine if you like properly sleep shopped and bought a house or something ridiculous or a helicopter. Oh my God, I have to tell, when we finish this, you have to remind me, I've got some big terrifying news something that I've done today that's really scary and I was a big boy and I'm very brave and I need to tell you about it but you have to remind me because you need to like I need to see you when I tell you about it Tony 26 envelope challenge without stickers My Merry Cashmas has no money in it. Mine does. <laughs> Only 88 likes. Come on, guys. Oh, yeah. We need to do 150 likes if we want to do a uh, uh, sneak peek. And the sneak peek is the latest 4.5K challenge. So it will be stunning. You will be like, oh, my God, my wig is in outer space. So Stephanie with a Y. Johnston. Hi, Penny. What did I do? What do you mean? <laughs> Hi, everyone. Mine has 100, 140 soon. That's good. Uh, so we've got a rainbow 4.5k here. So let's grab that. And then we have also got a black rock, paper, scissors, which are here. So we have a black one. I think the black one's the nicest one. <laughs> the amount of wigs I have to buy because of Ira. No, what you'll find is you just naturally have a wig underneath your wig, underneath your wig. <laughs> it's how wigs work. $900 in my Christmas binders ever. Amanda, that's incredible. Have you got a big family? Or are you just like really going out this year? $900 is a lot of money. Wow. It's impressive. Joy Allison, who has the best address, I won't tell you. It's so, it's such a cute uh, address. We've got a Till With It six pack. A 
love the look of the orange rock paper scissors we get the small scratches to reuse of all the zodiac scratches oh i don't know i bought mine in bulk off a like um like a distribution warehousey type place and you have to spend a certain amount to like get the benefit of the discount so um it wouldn't be cost effective but you could tr try like aliexpress or timu or maybe even amazon i'm not 100 percent sure um but they are 14 mil i believe i believe anyway uh nikki fountain that's a nice name as well So Nikki Fountain has ordered two um, Saving Challenge Volume 1 with pink dice. One, two. Three, four. And we want pink dice for these. Nine kids, seven grandkids. Right, that makes sense then. 97 likes if you haven't liked already. Oh, I like that. Hi, Bessie, sorry. Late was helping my brother move into his new home. How exciting for him. <laughs> I used to have to watch a playthrough because of the time difference. It's 8.05 a.m. Wednesday morning for me. Oh, nice. No, we don't have a like emoji. Siri, maybe that's a good idea. A like emoji. So people can tell me that they've liked. Uh, next hoodie should be green for sure. So we've got Tammy with an I. Uh, who's ordered solo. rainbow hoodie that has to be for like something that has to be for something crazy like maybe like i'm a ransacker <laughs> you can't go wrong with solo can you This is annoying me. Okay, next we have uh, Linda Keat. And it is a black rock, paper, scissors. I told you they were popular. And the new nude rainbow scratch off. How nice is she? Like, that's nice, right? Very pretty. I am so talented, I must say. <laughs> Maybe a rainbow hoodie for 2K on here. Maybe, yeah. Every time I... Well, we don't want a 2K emoji because then when we'll only really use that once, won't we? Every time I see Solo, I want to do it again, but I have so many others I want to do as well. Same, that's the thing. I just do mine the first time round, and I'm like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump on something else, but keep it in on the back burner for sure. For sure. New scratch off is cute. I'm really, really pleased with how it turned out. I knew I like didn't have. I don't have much for the nude girlies, but what we do have is 
is nice. It's cute. Okay, Dorothy Bingham. Uh, Dorothy's ordered a black rock, paper, scissors. Let's go, black rock, paper, scissors. Oh yeah, 150 likes for the rainbow hoodie. Yeah, that'd be a good idea. Because we can use that every time. Yeah, hopefully, Nikki. Okay, next is... Amy Louise McCum, McCum. And we've got a 6K poster and zipper. I don't know how many more of these I've got to make. I want the news. Oh, it's nothing that big, but I am a big, brave boy. <sighs> yeah, 6K challenge. I mean, we say it's new, but she's nearly sold out and she'll be gone making way for a new one. So I think there's, what, six of them left or something? Ow. So when I get the Mermaid 4.5K challenge, I should swap it out for my rainbow one I'm currently doing, or should I wait until I'm done and start the Mermaid one? Yeah. Yeah, literally, start start it again. Like, finish the rainbow, then do the mermaid. And then when you finish the mermaid, do a different colour one. 6K is almost over. Yeah, I've got like six left. Let's see, it's sold really, really quick. So when it's uh, gone, we'll bring in the new one, which I think we agreed we'd do a mermaid version. Yeah, the original one's cute. She's still on my wall. I'm still pleased with her. So I think if I do another poster challenge, I'll I'll go over the top. But right now she's uh she's looking cute there. Okay, let's take a look at this order. This order might be a bit of a big one. Uh Lucia Cox or Lucia. So we've got a pastel four and a half K. Right, let's go. Pastel four and a half K. Here she is. We've got a pink and a yellow heads and tails. So yellow and pink. And then we've also got a coffee and two car. So coffee is here, car is here. One, two, cute. Uh, off to work now. Have fun at work, Pam. What's your favourite music, Ira? Do you have Spotify playlist? Um, 
not really, I don't really listen to Spotify. I'm such a millennial that I still listen to most of my music on YouTube. And um, like go-tos for me are like Lana Del Rey, but I'll mostly listen to the music I listened to when I was a teenage boy. So a lot of Spice Girls and stuff like that. Um, yeah, Lana Del Rey is probably like the most current thing I really listen to. Um, but like a lot of stuff is just, I'm, I'm, I get really obsessed with one song and I listen to it on repeat until I hate the song. So at the moment, I am listen to, listening to literally on repeat, um, Two of Hearts. I don't, someone called Stacy. I don't know, but it's an old song. And I'm listening to it like literally over and over and over again. And I will eventually hate it, but right now it's the best thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> This one is Janai. So we've got every color of rock, paper, scissors. So we've got red, orange, yellow, green, green, blue, black, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, black and then we've also got three of the nude one two three is that everything yeah cool what big thing challenge will you do when you finish 20 oh why is that split when I finish 20K. So when I finish 20K, I do have a plan, but we need to have achieved 10K subscribers by then. So if you lot could pull your finger out and get me to 10K, then we can do that next uh, because it's gonna be a big one and a good one, but I can't do it before. Or I might do it and just be like, well, you, you lot can't have this because <laughs> Maybe I'll do that. I'll be like, yeah, I'm doing this. You can't have it yet because we're not at 10K. So sort it out. Solomon the cat has plonked himself in my lap to sleep, but now has aeroplane ears every time you rustle the packaging. <laughs> wow, we're already at 113 likes. That's wild. I want to see what rock, paper, I, do you know what I haven't, I'm going to send uh, Sugar Daddy's rock, paper, scissors and the, um, the what's it called, the, the jigsaw challenge with the next Patreon, just because it is cheaper for me to do it that way. So we're going to do it that way around. So you get it soon. Uh, Emily Thompson. And we're going to go blue rock, paper, scissors. Bessies, we're all subscribed. Oh my God, did someone buy all the rock, paper, scissors? No, not all of them. Oh yeah, someone bought one of each. I think there's plenty in stock still. I'm sure there is. British Seaside Pandas, Skeggy Blackpool. <laughs> okay. That blue one's yours. Nice. Thank you for ordering. I'll, I'll pat your happy mail on the bum. Boop, boop. Okay, Barb. Barb's order. Okay, I'm about to put something on the table. Uh, 
and I want to see an emoji rush and you'll, you'll know which emoji to use in a sec. That's right, forbidden emoji. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> Feral, I love it. Just feral behaviour. I love it. I love to see it. Okay, next order is Jack Denson. Who has ordered a red rock, paper, scissors? Cute. That binder probably is really beautiful. I mean, if we could see it, but it's forbidden, so we can't see it. So we would never know. Hi, Evelyn, how's it going? Everyone, I'm on holiday this week and just popped in to say hi and like the video. Well, nice to see you, Donna. Thanks for coming to hang out with us. Hundred and twenty one likes already. Wow, we are smashing through it. <laughs> the forbidden binders are nice. Like they're really like they're like hollow glitter and tie-dye. They're like like what's not to love? Okay, right. Eva Brown, if you're watching, this is a gift for you from someone. We got spooky candy. Place a new order. Nice. Thank you. You're still poorly. Oh no. I hope you get better soon. Uh, Victoria, that emoji says thank you. So Diana's ordered a pastel four and a half K. So let me grab one of them. And uh, looks like a green rock, paper, scissors. even put in the thank you card. Uh, black dice. Um, there's two challenges left, but I don't know if they're sold. Some of the dice are going to sugar daddies as well. Black and blue are sold out. There you go. Do 
Jennifer Carr has ordered a blue. <laughs> Diana, you won't um see like your name. The uh what's it called we'll go over the top of it the postage label so you won't see that part anyway so if i if i did spell it wrong it wouldn't have been end of the world well if you bought a black one you're all right and guess whose order is next i wish there was a way for the notes to be a smidgen larger yeah, it's literally the platform. Okay. Next we have Gillian Eastman. Have you got your emojis ready? Have you got your emojis ready? <laughs> oh no, Bev. Hope you feel better soon. <laughs> I love the emojis. It's forbidden by the forbidden by forbidden by them. Venka has ordered black, and that's the black one. Say goodbye to the last black one. My husband's listening and telling me I'm to be selling, not buying. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> What's he talking about? You've got to spend money to make money. <laughs> Thanks for being here, Stella. Uh... Bye to whoever's leaving. Thank you. Spending it is so much more fun, isn't it? That's why we're in the situation we're in, besties. Oh, look, we got Omar's order. Lovely Omar. Omar has ordered. Surprise. I didn't even realise we sold this many of these. Yeah, it's research. That's right. Oh, yeah, of course you were. I, I, <laughs> I said say goodbye to the black one. And I'm like, who's leaving? Like, a memory of an actual goldfish, me. <laughs> 22 likes left for sneak peek. Love it. Okay, next order is going to be a flatty, and it's Angela Reeve. We've got two save 300s. For whoever asked about 300s, that's what they look like. We've got a nudie patootie, and we've got two save 200s which are going to be sold out very soon. I need to work on restocking those, definitely. Uh, 
<laughs> it is you. Yeah, hopefully it will be after Etsy ban. I mean, like red, orange, yellow, they never historically sell very well anyway. So it's likely that it'll still be in stock when your band's ended. So hopefully. But what you could do is you could go back in time and be a sugar daddy for this current month and then you would have got a red one. Are we getting someone over the rainbow? Yeah, Gillian. Um, sugar daddies get that. That is already sent out. So we've got a 35 envelope challenge, a fuck it and a trip. So 35. Fuck it. Ugh. Trip. Oh, let me show you this as well. So these are my trip ones. These are the original ones, right? So that's what they look like. They're white on the back. As I'm getting them reprinted, I'm getting them like the same colour on the back. I don't know why, it doesn't cost as much. But um, yeah, so when I restock stuff, I'm just getting them on the back rather than just leaving them white. It just makes them a bit nicer, I think, anyway. Wait, we have sugar? Yeah. So the last sugar daddy mail I sent out was your four and a half Ks, uh, somewhere over the rainbow and the two dashboards. So yeah, it should be in transit for some of you. I did send it a while ago though. You like it, Siri? I just thought nobody really pays attention to the back. So normally I just leave them white, but like I'm going to start doing all of them like a colour on the back just to make it a bit nicer. So like as I redo the, um, what's it called? Right, we've got a big order now. Okay, let me get it all down so we can see what we've got. So baby girl, two baby girls. Uh, two baby boys. Um, then we've got a Shine Bright, a Farm match game, a 52 without stickers, um, Fishing for Silver, Valentine's, Christmas, uh, Pisces, Aries, Libra, Gemini, Sagittarius spelt wrong. Busy B. Where's she? Here she is. Busy B. Moon and back. Match day. Virgo. Leo. Scorpio. Taurus and Aquarius, Capriciacorn, and save the best to last, Cancer. Okay.
Yeah, it's a pretty big order, isn't it? Eighteen more likes to get to 150. I can't wait till April uh, 1. The Sugar Daddy, I'll be getting my first lot. Nice. Uh, all the baby boy scratchers, too cute. I have another grandson due to be born around six weeks. Cute. Uh, if you didn't see Somewhere Over the Rainbow in my Nordillion's 4.5k and dashboards... Ira, if you didn't see Somewhere Over the Rainbow, it wasn't in mine or Gillian's four and a half K and dashboards. Uh, can you rewatch it just to check? Because I'm very confident I put it in. I don't want to open up a parcel and like waste money on the envelope, if that makes sense. And I don't want to make waste. But I'm really, really sure that I put it in. If you didn't see Somewhere Over the Rainbow, it wasn't in mine or Gillian's four and a half K in dashboards. <sighs> I'm really confident it's in there. Do you want me to open it? Tell me if you want me to open it. Uh, emergency, car tax, uh, books, coffee. Car maintenance, car insurance, 22, birthdays, 44, car service, 40. That's a nice little bundle there. Definitely wasn't. Okay, hold on. Gillian. Julian, you didn't order it. Everything what you had is in there. Oh yeah, it's coming to you, sugar dad. It's on the way. <laughs> okay, moving on. Uh, it's on the way. Okay. Uh, this one's Becca Dow. So, what a nice sherbet -y. That looks cute together. So, if you're a sugar daddy and you paid last month, the Over the Rainbow will either be on its way or be in the next package. Looking, hold on, let me have a look. Yeah, so Over the Rainbow is on its way, unless Over the Rainbow came out before the last first, which I'm, I don't think it did. Um, if it came out before the last one, then it would have gone with the previous Sugar Daddies. But I know that I've sent one package already to this month's lot of Sugar Daddies. Does that make sense? 
And then one more will go to Sugar Daddies, but it'll be the Jigsaw and the, the, what's it called? Um, Jigsaw and the Rock, Paper, Scissors. France! France! Have you seen that um, meme? <laughs> It just depends when it came out, Bestie, because I definitely sent the right stuff to the right people. So if it came out before the first, which it may well have, I can't remember when I released it, but if it came out on the first, if you really think I've shortchanged you, just message me on uh, Patreon and I'll take a look into it. But um, yeah, I think I've... Um, I've not made any mistakes because I haven't had any left over. It might have been. That's what my impression was, but I don't know. I definitely sent them out because... Well, if, if you think I've shortchanged you, just message me on Patreon and I'll take a look, see if I've made a mistake. But I'm pretty sure I've done the right thing. Uh, Tracy Brown, a teal one. How beautiful. I need to get like tape and write Tracy's name on here. Just a little bit of tape and a permanent marker. We're coming up to the end of this packing, Bestie. It's so nice to just put these. It's just so nice to just put these in the post as they are. Oh, it's lovely. Right, next is Laura Sargent. You have to treat your sugar daddies better, Ira. I'm doing my best. <laughs> you just rip the box like Christmas. Okay, well, everybody, this is the last zesty orange binder. Everybody say goodbye. It just all it just all depends when things come out. So if they come out in your cycle, you'll get it. I just don't know. I, I, I just can't remember when things come out because we're releasing like at least one thing every week. So we release Jigsaw this week. Next week it's something else new. Oh, I think oh I might not have something next week <gasps> we might have a first week with nothing in it so everyone say goodbye to orange 30 more likes come on guys oh poor Ira, look what we did jillian <laughs> i hope you know i'm joking you treat all of us very well <laughs> uh, poor ira here's enough on his plate <laughs> please don't break ira i'm doing my best <laughs> simone thinker simone thinker Okay, are we ready? Are we ready with the emoji, everybody? <laughs> I have to cause chaos. It's my job. Ira said so. That is very, very true, Beth. <laughs> chaos is your middle name. <laughs> Jimmy, wrong emoji. <laughs> Daniel, wrong emoji. <laughs> How many likes we on? Okay, last order of the night goes to Rebecca Clark. We've got 
through it. It's good work tonight. We're ready for the news. <laughs> This ain't forbidden. You can buy these. 142. Oh, that's good. Eight more likes and we've got it. Nice. That's the last order done. We done good work tonight. Now, as is custom, I have to tidy up. So you can um, say hello to yourselves while I do that because I, I literally won't be able to continue this stream unless I've tidied up. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Are you being nice to each other? So baby, pull me closer. Na, 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 na. Hi. <sighs> okay, right. All back to being tidy-ish. I need my phones. That was a bit wobbly. How, how long we got? <gasps> 13 more minutes till this live stream ends. We're doing good. Um, we are on 145 likes, so we're doing really good. Why are those binders looking extra beautiful? Because they are forbidden. I think so. <laughs> uh, teamwork makes the dream work. It really does. Are the pirates letting you have any more orange binders? I don't think I ordered orange. <laughs> when I ordered, we look how shiny I am. When I ordered, we had so many orange. So I ordered 16 colours last time. So I will order the other four, like, but I've got loads of blue and loads of brown, like, I'll show you. There, there, loads of leopard print, loads of blue, loads of brown. What I don't have very much of is the croc forbidden, the orange swirl, the pink swirl, and yeah, it's pretty much all, oh, it's just devastating. 147 likes, uh, but I need to, before I do that, I need to reorder zippers because otherwise I'm gonna run out of those really soon. Uh, Daniel, I broke Ira once. It's not very difficult to break me. <laughs> we worked hard tonight. Pat yourselves on the back. Uh, mark that tattoo on your shoulder. <laughs> right. When are we getting the Angel and the North Challenge placeholder? We know we are. Uh, <laughs> potentially. Hit 50 subbies. Two more. Three more. Uh, where do you get your zippers from, Ira? Um, I buy from a wholesaler in China. Ira, when are we getting the Angel of the North? No, we're not doing that. <laughs> we're not doing that. Okay, so big news today. I done something really scary and it, it was scary to me. I need to charge one of these phones because... I need to transfer some files over tonight. Uh, I did something really scary today. I decided to, and this is not financial advice by any means, but I've moved £30,000 out of my Monzo account. And I am doing a, oh, what is it called? It's an NSNI thing. Uh, it's called a...
premium bonds, right? So I've been learning all about them, right? So basically, premium bonds uh, you, is like a government thing. Your money is super, super safe. So when you put money into there, you will never lose money, right? But you may not get as much interest as when you put it into a normal account, right? So how it works is for every pound you put into it, you uh, that you buy every month, you're basically... Uh, put into a drawer. So I'm going to put in £30,000, which means I will have 30,000 opportunities to win. And you can sometimes win £25, which is more interest, like more interest than you would normally get. Sometimes you can win nothing. Sometimes you can win a million pounds. So I did that. It was scary. Even though it was, I felt like I had my big boy pants on and I think I was very brave and I think I deserve a cake because like, I thought it was scary to do because, I don't know, I, thought, I just thought it was scary. We are, 100, we are at 150 likes. Um, so that's what I've done. Uh, I still kept £4,000 aside because I'm putting that into my LISA um, very, very soon, April, when the new financial year rolls around. Um, but yeah, can you imagine if I won a million pounds? I was talking about what I would do if I had a million pounds. I would just buy a house just immediately. I'd buy like a 300 to 400,000 pound house just for me and the cats. I'd probably spend a gr 100 grand doing it up. I'd go on a massive holiday and then I'd put like 100,000 pounds into the business and like get an editor and make my life a lot easier. Like it would just be not life changing, but it would be... Uh, <coughs> <laughs> Sorry, it would be incredible what I could do with that. Can you imagine if I just had no mortgage? Oh, it'd be so good. Yeah, with this one, you can withdraw it. Anytime. Like, don't, do your own research. But from what I understand, you can withdraw it at any time. Um, and yeah, you can you can grab it at any time. There's no penalties for withdrawing it either. But the more money you have in there, the better. And you can have up to £50,000 in there. So what I've decided is that if I win anything, it buys me more premium bonds, which gives me more opportunity to win until you get up to £50,000. Then if you get any um, winnings or anything like that, it, it you have to take it. It puts it into your bank account. Uh, yeah. Does it really feel weird that 30k in debt, now 30k in saving? I know. It's wild. But like, at, at one side of me is like, yeah, fantastic. I've got 30k in savings. But I'm like, I've got to buy a house soon. And I was talking to Kyla today. It's like, I could buy a house tomorrow. Like, I could fully buy a house tomorrow. But am I ready for all of that? Um, like, it, it just makes so much more sense if I can save up as much as I possibly can so I can pay in cash for as much of the house as I possibly can so my mortgage is smaller and then I can do the things that I want to do. Um, because, like, the thought of overpaying... If I bought a house tomorrow and overpaid and just the amount of interest there'd be like the, the the more money I can have now to chuck at a house the better so yeah can you if I want a million pounds I would draw out the whole fucking lot and do a cash stuff with you lot <laughs> can you imagine it'd be like a 20 hour live stream five ten five I'd have to get some help in just to count it it'd be ridiculous my stepfather was always lucky with his premium bonds Mm. So we're supposed to close on our house this Thursday, but due to pay pressure, we can't close yet. Foxy, you got like just hold on, you'll get that soon. That would be one epic day if you won the one million. Literally, my life would not change if I won. A million pounds is not a life changing amount of money, but it would make life a lot easier. So being able to invest a hundred thousand pounds into this business would catapult this business no end, like no end. It would be wild the things that we could do then also um being able to just buy a house and then I don't have to worry about stuff like it'd just be just incredible can you imagine if I didn't have to rely on like Etsy income like constantly and I could just put everything I earn into Etsy it'd just be wild I'd pay a web designer to get my website sorted. Oh, the stuff I'd do. Uh, 
I've heard too many people talk about being helpful because they bought too early or without enough save to put towards a down payment. No rush when the time is right. Exactly. So I feel like, you know, I could get approved for a mortgage tomorrow with the money that I've saved up, like, easily. But then I'd have a house and nothing else. But if I've got £100,000 to throw at a house, then I've only got a £150,000 mortgage, which means that I've got so much more left over. And then an overpayment feels better. I'm like, they say that if you have a £250,000 mortgage, you are literally paying interest for the first 10 months. Like, like that's it. Yeah, it, it's scary. Uh, houses for sale around me are half, three quarters of a million. It would be gone so fast. Yeah, I mean, a lot of them are very expensive near me, but I don't want anything big at all. It's just me and the cats, isn't it? I want two bedrooms, but I want as much house as I can possibly get. Always want to go on and deal a load of it. Seems such a good idea to not get greedy. That's the thing, I'd get greedy on there. Uh, is a Lisa same as help to, Lisa is n n not like help to buy. I'm not really sure what help to, yes, it is actually. So it's the government thing where you get 25%. Uh, I was thinking about transferring from help to buy to L Lisa so I can put more money a month, but researching, I'm getting good things and bad, bad things. Lisa for me is really good. It just means that it is a lot, I cannot take that money unless I retire um, or buy my first home. Other than that, I can't take the money out. And if I want to, there's the penalties are 25%. So you would, you they just hold your money for you. So you don't lose anything, but it'd be nice to get that extra grand every year. The house market right now is crazy. People are overpaying. We're getting 150,000 off the market value of a house because it's uh, my parents. That's wild. Yeah, it's house prices are crazy, but they're only going to get worse. Like, I feel like when you look at prices of houses, you're like, oh, it could, like, surely it'll crash at some point. And it never does. It only gets tougher. Um, I have a part, part by part rent. Help me to get on the market. Rental prices in Bristol are crazy. This is actually cheaper. Nice. Where would you... Where would you direct the 100k in the business, Ira? So uh, primarily I would pay for Kyla full time. Having someone to just do orders for me and do that so I can focus on all the other bits would be really, really helpful. I would pay for like professional services, like getting a website up together. Um, I'd probably get someone to help me with marketing as well. And then I would invest a lot into never running out of stock of binders um i'd get a, a ton of inventory and a lot of storage i do a lot of that stuff so like there's stuff that i really want to get after and get hold of but what, what i want to really spend a lot of my time doing is creating stuff like creating shorts and videos and stuff like that and then being able to pass that over to an editor that can just make it the best it can be um because i feel like i'm doing about 20 jobs at the moment and I'm only doing them okay it'd be lovely to give things to professionals uh, and while I'd still want to pack orders I'd still do all these live streams and stuff like that not worrying about them and having to stop doing editing because I need to jump on this and then stop doing that because I need to jump on that would be like um like such a blessing but you know I'm still absolutely living my dream and I wouldn't have it any other way right now uh you should do a budget page for 100k. Can you imagine? Uh, I'm scared for when my son gets old enough to buy a house. He's 11 now. Hopefully the market will not be crazy like it is now. You would need a warehouse for all your inventory. Literally. Can you imagine if I'm like, okay, I've got every binder. What binder do you want? I've got them all. Like, that would be it, wouldn't it? I'd get a load of saving challenges, like, made. I'd have, like, four and a half Ks coming out of my ass. Like, it'd be brilliant. They were interviewing people who were calling out youngsters for not saving enough and buying coffees, and one woman had actually inherited her parents' house. Yeah. Wild. Right, we want to do sneak peek because it's just gone 10 o'clock. So let me grab this for you because I think you will like it. So we're doing the 4.5K. Uh, is that one or two? Here's another one. It's all right, we'll just show you one. Four and a half K. 
Um, but the new one after Mermaid is going to be a butterfly one. So all the dice are pastel pink, red, orange, yellow, cream, black, white, monarch butterfly style. So we're very, very orange. And let me flip the camera. This is what she looks like. So that's three different challenges there. So that's one, that's one, that's one. And on the back, it's the same colour. So just loads of butterflies everywhere. I just think it's really, really cute. And when it's all together in all of the warm tones, it's going to look really, really nice. So that is your sneak peek for tonight. <laughs> Hope it was worth it. Put that back in the trash. Uh, are we making wills for our son and he's the only child will get a house so he can do what he wants of it? Yeah. I'm inheriting my grandma's house, uh, the one who's sick. So I think I'm going to take out a loan to remodel versus having a mortgage. Yeah. Tammy and Tina are going to lose their shit, right? What a beaut. Butterfly, when is it coming out? Uh, it'll be out really soon. So I've ordered the the backings to go in the zippers and I've ordered the dice. So the dice will be about two weeks. So if I can get everything done, probably about three weeks they'll be out. I'm glad you like it. So the dice are red, orange, bright yellow, cream, white, pale pink and like, um, What's that colour? Like a dark red, like wine colour. And also we're restocking Mermaid. So we're going to restock a hundred Mermaid. So hopefully that will shut you up for five minutes. Just felt it was unfair as she hadn't saved for hers or struggled with a mortgage and it was inherited. Oh, my birthday is in three weeks on the 18th. Nice. Merlot. Yeah, I'd call it a wine colour, I would. But it's almost purple but it's still when it when you have it together with all of those like warmer colors uh it's gonna look really nice so like our collection of four and a half k is a nude a bright a cool toned more mermaid a warm toned butterfly and pastel so there's five really really cute ones and there may or may not be some cute ones coming out in you know advent calendars you never know uh -huh. So excited for the mermaid restock. So mermaid will be restocked first because I know you are feral for it. And that, uh, how on earth do you sell out of 100 in a week? Like how on earth did that happen? So yeah, a lot of vinyl to cut out. But yeah, we're doing really good. So tomorrow, my plan for tomorrow, Bestie, is to edit all of the videos that I filmed today. So I filmed a ton of videos today. I feel really on top. So if you're a channel member of uh, Budget with Ira, you're gonna see, hopefully, if I can get my bum and gear, hopefully you're gonna see about four additional videos added. Uh, and then I'm gonna do a load of shorts as well. <coughs> and then you will get my check-in and that's a beautiful check-in. And obviously, if you're a channel member, you would have seen that already. Uh, Thursday, we'll be back here live. What we might do is some more packing. But if anybody wants to see anything else, let me know now. Friday's video is uh, cash stuffing. Um, that's already uploaded as well, if you're a channel member. Saturday's video is cash stuffing. And if you're a channel member, you've seen that. Sunday's video is another budget bestie. And if you're a channel member, you've already seen that. Oh, what I didn't show you is what these look like. This is the jigsaw challenge. Jigsaw. So it's all in there. So some bags are yellow, some are red. And this, how cute is this? This is what the cash envelope looks like. So it says Christmas presents. And on the black, it's green. And originally, I was going to have it to look like this, right? I was gonna put it the other way around, but um, I guess it's up to you. You can do it either way you want. So if you want that at the back and then that there, because your money's gonna go in the front anyway, you can do it that way around. But I thought, pff, it's nice. I didn't want to make it the same both sides, but yeah. But um, if you want to make the dice together, the jigsaw together, but um, it's really nice. The pieces of the jigsaw, they're the same 400 GSM card that you get for like the scratch offs and the dashboard. So it's nice and thick and really, really cute. So yeah, they're going out there. That's a sugar daddy one that is. Uh, is everyone doing all of the four and a half K at the same time? I'm doing the first thousand first. That's a good idea. 
I'm just doing all of them at once just to get it done. Butterfly to me symbolizes transformation. Yeah, butterflies in budgeting is like a good idea. Uh, I'm doing all the hundreds at once and then I'm done and move on to the 200s, so on. I've got four of them. Four. Are you going to get the fifth one, Foxy? <laughs> I'm doing the whole four and a half K at once. Bestie. Good on ya. I'm rolling all the dice. Must be crazy, Stephanie. Oh my God. I am having palpitations. Next couple of weeks, Tammy. I, I, uh, I don't mean it's unfair to inherit a house. Just unfair to comment about other people's saving spending. Yeah, I get it. Uh, Ira, re-show it. I'll just put it back in the trash. Might have to roll twice a week now so I can start my mermaid one. <laughs> Rewatch it's a sneak peek. It is a sneak peek. So she said, no, no more. Okay, so um, yeah, that's what we'll do. So next Thursday, we'll probably pack a couple orders. I don't have very many orders open at the moment. I think I'm down to like 15 orders. So whatever we've got, we'll pack on Thursday. Uh, I've got stuff to do tomorrow. So I'm going to be a quiet little mouse tomorrow getting... <sighs> Stuff done. <sighs> I didn't get much sleep last night. I was up till 3am. Uh, but I will go to the post office because I got that lot to send. So cool. All right. You just ordered two. <laughs> Why did you order two? I'm going to send you one. Okay. <laughs> Power Rangers saving challenge. I, I, I can't do anything licensed. I'd love to. I can't do anything licensed. That's why we had to have Wizard Child and um, Piggy Pals. Oh, you made two orders. Okay. Okay. I, I don't, I'll look at it tomorrow. I'm too tired to understand. <laughs> what you're saying is perfect English, but it's not going in my brain. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Dicey license will get him shut down quick. Absolutely. Various bits and bobs. Pack with me live on April 2nd. Let's have a look at the calendar. Uh, pack with me live will be... Um, oh, God, that'd be a brutal... No, that'd be okay. We'll do Tuesday, April the 2nd for the Pack with me live. Um, and I will pack Patreon on Thursday the 4th during the day. And we'll do something chill Thursday the 4th. Probably play that computer game. I'm very sorry, but it was good. Ira is spoken. <laughs> I'm confusing myself, Jillian. <laughs> so yeah, we'll do that. That's what we'll do. And in the meantime, have a lovely, lovely um, time. I will see you all on Thursday and we'll, we'll get some stuff done, bestie. Yeah, by the time we're doing the live, we've got jigsaw puzzles, we'll have a whole new collection. And if you're a Patreon, the new collection is up on Patreon. So I hope you like it. No emojis to spoil it. But um, yeah, I hope you like it. <laughs> and um, I will see you all very, very soon. Have a good night, besties. And I will see you soon, besties. Get to bed early. I know. All right. Bye, bestie. Bye.